This is for you, America, reviewing and firing a cannon for 4th of July. Bought a Traeger cannon from TraegerCannons.com, and these are our parts it came with. First is the base, which gets screwed to a piece of wood with a shown screw. And then there's the cannon body, which gets two uh, different diameter barrels. My son painted a piece of wood, and we drilled the base to it. Here's the simple process of assembling the cannon. We're currently building the cannon. I painted the uh, weight at the bottom. The brick. Attaching the front of the cannon. Okay. That's it. That's a completely finished um, shotgun shell cannon. Apparently, showing you how you would load it. Pull back the keychain looking part, and then you add the pin. Pull out that pin, and it fires. Gotta put it back now. Mm -hmm. It's okay. We'll travel with it like this. Okay. Beautiful. I attached the lanyard to the pin and we brought the 209 primers. Now we test fire the can. Second test fire. Well, the lanyard tips the cannon over, so we had to put a weight on which to yeah. put the can. Firing three, two, one. We forgot to show the loading sequence, so here it goes. The pin goes in first, then you gotta unscrew the front part of the barrel, and the 209 primer goes right inside the barrel right there. As you can see, Right here, I'm inserting the 209 primer. Then you uh, screw back on, and you put the BB inside the barrel. And then push the BB back with a ramrod. The BB is actually uh, already inside the barrel at this point. I forgot to make that on video. But you just push it back, and you're ready to fire. Hope you enjoyed my video. Please like and subscribe and happy birthday, America.